With just 10 watts of LED light, the Air Garden Sprout has turned out to be one of my favorite models. I enjoy using it to grow single heads of lettuce, as well as using the seed deck for starting seedlings for my other larger air gardens. I also start larger plants such as the zucchini plants in the back of the lettuce. But the amazing thing is what I'm about to show you. Both of these plants have grown and stayed relatively compact. They've put out multiple branching leaves and partially because this variety of zucchini is parthenocarpic. It is inclined to put on fruit in spite of not having a pollinator. Imagine my surprise when these two tiny plants started to produce zucchinis. Currently, I have two juvenile zucchinis that have formed and more that look like they are on the way. The zucchini that is in the middle slot of the three seems to be the dominant plant. The one that is behind it is a little lackluster in comparison. So far, the only thing that I have done is I've found a couple leaves that needed to be pruned off. One was underneath another leaf and had died off where it was shaded out. And just for general housekeeping, I clipped that off at the base, as well as I had another leaf that was uh, down underneath as one of the seedling leaves that was eventually starting to die off because a uh, plant do not have leaves usually that last forever. It's nice to pull off some of the larger growth and allow the fresh growth to start to come forward and to start to uh, take over where the uh, older leaves start to fell. So by doing some gradual, almost like bonsai type pruning under the 10 watt light, I am actually expecting to see some harvestable zucchini. The question is how large will they grow and how many will I get? I will probably want to take out the back plant and just allow this middle plant to grow and this is just a little something that I wanted to share with everyone because Prior to this, I would have said it was crazy to even consider growing such a large plant as a bush zucchini plant in a 10 watt Aero Garden Sprout that has only less than a half gallon of water in it. Nutrient use has not been excessive either, probably because the plant is smaller in stature than one that was going to be grown in a larger unit. So it has been very normal in comparison to, say, three heads of lettuce in one of these units in terms of topping off with water and feeding with the air garden nutrients as they recommend for the sprout unit, which is about every 14 days. Don't expect me to continue to grow bush squash in air garden sprouts. However, this has been a fun experiment and one that expands the horizons of what can be grown.